My favorite junk knife got even better. You know this one? This is junk knife, why I call it? Because it's under $50. I don't mind beating it up. I don't mind breaking it. I don't mind making it dirty. It's just a really cheap knife. It's just like a tool opening it. Boxes, breaking them up. Uh, so it's not a big deal. As you can see, I've been using it a lot. Getting a little bit of tape glue on it. Still really sharp. So this is definitely not $50 anymore. It's probably worth like $10 or $12 because it's so beat up um, but I really like it because it's so skinny it fits your pocket so easily front pocket or like on your t-shirt it is easy to flip it out but with my big hands it's not my favorite to flipping it out with this thumb stud it's beautiful design fish scales over here it's just not my thing the blade been really good I see a little like dinks and such I'll have to sharpen it up but this junk knife got even better or just didn't even notice it uh, this thing is $51 and it's a flipper from the back it doesn't have the fish scale but still beautiful I love how small it is clip is a little bit different kind of like this clip a little bit better you see it, it's big so it's much shorter and also the knife seems to be a little bit shorter too just a tiny tiny little bit not too much though but i love it how easy it is to flick it out now this traditional flipper from the back yeah this is the everyday knife i'm gonna be using i love how short it is skinny it is i mean looking like a fishing knife but it's just so nice that you don't have to have this bulging knife in your pocket it looks like as big as a pen and boom you see how easy it is to flick it out versus this one it's still a nice knife it's just not as fun and also if you flick it multiple times it's actually hurting your thumb after a while versus this one is very easy look at that easy to close it easy to open it every time and it's not gonna hurt you it's so nice so yeah, this is going to be my everyday junk knife to where I'm just going to be beating it up. So probably going to retire this one. This is why I don't even care about sharpening cheap knives. When I get beat up and get really, really old, I just go ahead and buy myself a different one. Most of the time they will improve the similar knife and make it better. Or just, um, I'll just get a new one instead of sharpening it so that way it's... A nice new knife and ready to go for like a really easy jobs it's really sharp too uh, there is a steel Rogers design 1797 CRKT versus this one Rogers design 1797 same thing but you know what it is pretty much the same the blade and the handle yeah they're actually the same okay nice i don't know i thought maybe because of the clip i thought it was a little bit bigger yeah i guess over here it points out versus right here it's cut off that's what makes it looks bigger let me know in comments below which uh, knife you use under 50 dollars that you beat up every day and just use it every single day and don't care about that it's gonna go uh, bad or broken